In this video, we are going to talk about a standalone expert advisor that is going to actually trade whenever the price is below this yellow line here. This is a moving average. We have already made a sell trade. And in this video, we are going to find out how to do a standalone expert advisor that actually trades in MQL4. To do that, please click on the little button here or press F4 on your keyboard. Now you should see the Meta Editor window and here you want to click on File, New, Expert Advisor from Template, Continue. I will call this version Simple Standalone SMA. Click on Continue, Continue and Finish. Now you can remove everything above the on tick function and let's also delete the two command lines here. Okay, let's start by creating a string variable for the signal. That variable will be also called signal and we don't assign a value here because we are going to calculate it later on. To calculate it, we use the built-in IMA function that comes with MQL4. It will calculate the moving average for the current symbol on the chart and the currently selected period on that chart. For example, I'm on the one minute chart right now. We want to calculate the moving average for 20 candles. I don't want to use a shift value. I could move the moving average drawing to the right or to the left, but we are going to use a zero shift value here. Mode underscore SMA will calculate the simple moving average. Price underscore close will use the close price for the calculation. And the last value here is candle zero. That's the current candle. I could also calculate the moving average based on one of the other candles here. But in this simple version, we are going to use the current candle. And if the moving average is below the current price, so if my moving average is below the close price for candle zero, and please notice that close for candle zero actually doesn't exist, because candle zero is always the candle that is just in development, and close price for candle zero gives you the current price here, and when that price is bigger than the moving average value. We want to set the signal variable to buy, so we assign the word buy to our signal. And guess what? If the moving average is above the current price, so if my moving average is bigger than the current price, we want to set the signal variable to sell, so we assign the word sell to our signal. Now let's actually buy something. And when the signal equals buy and orders total equals zero, and that is true when we have no open orders, we use the order send command to buy 10 micro lot, and the take profit value is 150 points above the ask price. If you are interested in the order send command, just mark it here and press F1, and you will see how it works. But let's continue with the selling part. To sell 10 microlot, we check if the signal equals sell and if we have no open orders. And in that case, we use the order send statement to sell 10 microlot. And this time the take profit value will be 150 points below the bid price. Please notice that we use OP underscore buy to buy something and op underscore sell to sell something. That's almost it. In the last step, we use the command function to output the words the current signal is and the calculated signal on our chart. Okay, so far so good. Please click on the compile button or press F7 on your keyboard. You should see no errors. We have two warnings because we could use the return value for order send but for this simple example, everything is okay. We don't use that. So now please click here or press F4 to go back to MetaTrader. And in MetaTrader, we click on View, 
strategy tester or press ctrl and r here in the strategy tester please select the simple standalone sma x4 file mark the option for the visual mode and start your test and here is our little expert advisor at work we have already made a sell trade because the price is below the moving average line here. And now you know how to create a standalone expert advisor to automatically trade a moving average. And you have coded it yourself with a few lines of MQL4 code.